Experts say that 73% of household accidents happen in one particular room. Be seeing you, my friend. Have you seen my dad? <laughs> From the creators of Shrek and Madagascar <laughs> oh. comes the story of a pampered yeah. pet mouse. <laughs> and his first time <gasps> out of the house. What is this place? It's an amazing world right under our feet. It's a real city. But there's one now, thing he knows. I have got to get home. The captain of the Jammy Doctor might be able to help you. Now... Hello, handsome. He's making a deal. Your own hand. And getting involved... Boss, we're back. ...with the wrong crowd. Ah, he's a madman! Run away! Run! This holiday season... Oh, no! Down here, he's being chased. You may now kiss the bride. <laughs> Back home... Look at the size of that monster! He's being replaced. I will be the best pet ever. Rodents. And the mouse who's never been on his own... <laughs> ...is learning to face danger on a fantastic journey home. There are things I want to do, sights I want to see. That's not one of them. when you hit the water. I kept my legs straight, Spike. Oh. <laughs> Flushed away. I think I could learn to like this place. want us to see. We hear what they want us to hear. They think we can't handle the truth. <laughs> All clear! They're probably right. Ah. <laughs> uh, Moo? Otis, you're gonna have to grow up one day. If you're trying to groom me to be the big leader, it's not me, Pop. Eh. I'm just out trying to have some fun. Coming to DVD. As if I needed to say it again. Rule number one, no swimming in the pond. Manabunga! Rule number two, there's to be no watching television through the farmhouse window. It's a touchdown! Oh, that is my man! And number three, standing on two legs is only permitted when humans are nowhere in sight. <laughs> From Paramount Home Entertainment. There is a cow outside. There's a cow farm. You're gonna find cows outside. And Nickelodeon movies. <laughs> you got them! Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> They're not gonna run for it, let's go. Oh, milk me. We got him! <laughs> Otis the Coyote. Hey. Sorry, man. I'm nervous. What happens in the barnyard? <laughs> Let's go. Stays in the barnyard. Howdy. I'm gonna go right in your ear. <laughs> That's called cow tipping. <laughs> hey, I'm in charge, right? I love the new you, Otis. <laughs> <laughs> Barnyard, the original party animals. You really ordered a lot of pizzas. <laughs> Dude, I got an arm! Right, yes! Agent confirmed. 
Ten by to go live. On my mark. Five. You have a, a wife, a girlfriend? Four. Three. Whoever she is, I'm gonna find her. Two. I'm gonna hurt her. One. And then I'm gonna kill you right in front of her. What are you not telling me? hottest years ever measured, they've all occurred in the last 14 years. And the hottest of all was 2005. The scientific consensus is that we are causing global warming. I am Al Gore. I used to be the next president of the United States of America. <laughs> this is Patagonia, 75 years ago, and the same glacier today. This is Mount Kilimanjaro. 30 years ago, and last year, within the decade, there will be no more snows of Kilimanjaro. This is really not a political issue so much as a moral issue. The temperature increases are taking place all over the world, and that's causing stronger storms. This is the biggest crisis in the history of this country. Early this morning, Hurricane Katrina slammed into New Orleans. Is it possible that we should prepare against other threats besides terrorists? From Paramount Classics comes a film that has shocked audiences everywhere they've seen it. The Arctic is experiencing faster melting. If this were to go, sea level worldwide would go up 20 feet. This is what would happen in Florida, around Shanghai, home to 40 million people. The area around Calcutta, 60 million. Here's Manhattan. The World Trade Center Memorial would be underwater. Think of the impact of a couple hundred thousand refugees, and then imagine a hundred 